ClearPath Operational Mode 8. Follow Digital Velocity Command. Follow Digital Velocity Command is the mode to use when you need to programmatically control the motor speed with specific velocity patterns or a wide or continuously variable range of possible speeds. To use this mode, you supply a frequency or PWM command signal that is proportional to your desired speed. ClearPath uses these digital command formats because they are more noise immune than analog command signals. To demo this feature, I'm going to use a function generator for the command signal, but most people will use a PLC or other inexpensive source. To set up this mode, connect ClearPath to the MSP software, and under the Mode menu, select Follow Digital Velocity Command. As you can see, there are three options in this mode regarding the type of speed signal you can use. Bipolar PWM, unipolar PWM, and frequency. So to use this mode, first decide whether you'd like to vary your speed using changes in PWM duty cycle or changes in frequency. Frequency mode and unipolar PWM mode work in a similar way. You have defined minimum and maximum frequencies, or PWM duty cycles, and they correspond to zero speed and your user-defined max speed, respectively. For unipolar PWM, the minimum and maximum duty cycles are fixed at 0% and 100%. For frequency, the minimum and maximum are user-defined. In both modes, the motor direction is set by turning input A on or off. In this demo, I'll do this with a switch, but in many applications you would use a programmed digital output from your PLC. Your acceleration and deceleration are determined by how fast you change your command signal, but for simplicity you can also just change your command abruptly without worrying about ramping between speeds and let ClearPath automatically make smooth transitions. Now I can make large jumps in the commanded speed, but still ramp smoothly from one speed to the next. The acceleration and deceleration limits can also be used for safety or to protect your mechanical systems from being overdriven. The RAS jerk limiting feature can automatically smooth the transitions between different speeds so that you don't have to worry about writing complex software to do this. Finally, ClearPath has a bipolar PWM mode, where 0 PWM and 100% PWM correspond to max speed in opposite directions, and 50% means zero speed. This mode is perfect for those of you who want to replace brush motors powered by H-Bridge PWM drives without having to change any software. That's because H-Bridge drives naturally output bipolar PWM. You just hook the drive output to ClearPath's PWM input and you're done. If you need programmatic control, but only up to four different velocities, ramp up down to selected velocity may be the right mode for you. If you need continuously variable speed with manual control, watch the video on manual velocity control mode.